All right, guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Angel with Angel Spiritual Messages. This is going to be the next 72 for the sign of Libra. Um, I am going to um, make this a timeless reading. That means whenever you find it, it is meant for you to find it. Um, just reverse the roles as need be. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. Please be nice in the comments. Also, if it doesn't resonate, please check your other placements. And if you would, please like, comment, share, and subscribe as I would greatly appreciate it. Um, Libra, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are doing amazing. Let's go ahead and get into it. Um, Spirit, if you would, please give me one card on Libra and what they should be focused on in the next 72 hours. One Moonology card for Libra and what they should be focused on in the next 72 hours. I will also pull some Amira Oracles and clarify those Amira Oracles with the Tarot. What should Libra be focused on in the next 72? Let's see. Ooh, it just jumped out there. And as a matter of fact, it was two cards. So I'm going to take them. Um, believe in the impossible blue moon and step out of your comfort zone. All right. Here's the thing. These both go hand in hand and I like it. And spirit wanted you to have this message. That's why two of them came out at one time, um, even before I could start shuffling. So believe in the impossible. Look, you have to know that you are worthy of anything that your heart desires. There is nothing too big for the art of manifestation. If you believe it, you can achieve it. That is not just a saying, it is reality. So if you believe it, you can achieve it. Believe in the impossible and it will work out for you. I think some of you guys are having some difficulties in life right now, whether it's financial, career, family, relationships. Just believe in the impossible and know that all of these things can work themselves out. Step outside of your comfort zone, North Node. So please make sure that you don't keep yourself bottled up. Do things out of the ordinary. So if you typically um, have a fight with someone you're in a relationship with and you always wait on them to reach out to you, step out of your comfort zone and make the first move. If you are sitting in meetings at work and um, you're always just kind of sitting back, never really giving your ideas, um, try to give some of your ideas in some of those meetings. Step outside of your comfort zone. If you're used to staying in the house a lot, um, it's time that you get out and explore life and that you do things that you're not typically um, doing on a regular basis. So spirit is supporting it. It's very important that you do so. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pull some Amira. I'm going to clarify all of these cards with the tarot. Spirit, if you would please give me some Amira cards on what Libra should be um, expecting in the next 72 hours. What other messages should Libra be expecting to possibly occur in the next 72 hours? All right. Thank you, Spirit. What other messages? What other messages? All right. I have some messages here. So I have karma, um, toxic story, new opportunity. So it looks like, um, you were in a situation where someone has completely wronged you, whether it was w with, um, work or relationship or family members or what have you, but it looks like this person or, and or place um, being a job is going to seek karma or receive karma for the bad that they have done to you. Um, so if it was a boss, then maybe that boss won't be there anymore. If it was a family member, maybe they'll come back and apologize because thing is just so many things are just falling apart for them. If it's a relationship, then maybe they will start to have lots of downfalls with the people in which they come in contact with after you. Um, but karma is definitely going to be served in your favor in the next 72 hours. 
a mature woman. So it looks like someone is going to run into a mature woman. Either this can be male and or female. Please reverse the roles because I do have males that watch my channel as well. Um, so some of you are going to be rolling in, up on or into a mature woman who has their act together, high society type of uh, individual who's going to be very attracted to you. So just be on the lookout for that um fair male lighter than dark so some of you guys are going to encounter either a male or female that is of a lighter skin that may have an interest in you as well in the next 72 hours just keep these um different type of characteristics in mind when you run into these people and say oh that is from my reading so that is someone i probably need to get to know but i'm going to use tarot to find out what it's all about open relationships non-committal um, casual openness. So it looks like some of you guys are going to enter into a casual relationship with someone where you both are mutually not wanting anything serious. You're both just wanting to go out and have fun and you guys are not looking for anything um, with relation to anything solid. It looks like you guys may have both experienced some tough times and relationships and you're just kind of wanting to um, just go out and have fun and, and, and keep it lighthearted. Um, next card, control. So it's going to be very important that you try to control yourself as well as your temper um, in the next 72 hours because I think someone is going to try to test those boundaries that you call patience and push them to their limit. So um, that is what I get from that. I'm going to go ahead and pull some tarot and we will find out exactly um, what spirit has for us. Spirit, if you would, please, for the greatest and highest good of the sign of Libra, let me um, receive two clarification cards on the Believe in the Impossible. What is this card about, Spirit? Why is that card there for Libra in the next 24 hours? For Libra in the next 24 hours, why is that Believe in the Impossible card present? Two cards, Spirit. The lovers in reverse and the two of wands. Okay. Yeah. So what it looks like is, um, with this situation, you are in a relationship with someone that you really love, um, and they love you. It is a mutual choice that you both have made. Um, but it looks like there's some difficulty in that relationship and, um, it looks like possibly you or the other person is thinking about walking away. Um, but spirit is saying, um, believe in the impossible. This situation can turn around. Um, I would just say be positive and mature about it. And I think it is going to turn around within the next 72 hours. So um, this is a situation that is going to be rectified. Um, so just hang on. And like Spirit said, believe in the impossible. Because it's the, the, the ability to change or fix this situation is going to be sent to you in a download by spirit so you will know what you need to do in order to fix this situation and that goes for the person that is watching um this video okay spirit is sending that message directly to you because you're the one who's seeking guidance regarding it um give me one no excuse me spirit give me two on the stepping out of your comfort zone what's that about and it may be with regard to this um, believe in the impossible as well, this relationship. But give me two spirit. We'll see. The magician in the upright and the six of wands in reverse. Yes. So it definitely is with regard to a relationship and a, a successful new beginning. You're trying to manifest um, a win-win uh, outcome in a relationship. So I'm assuming that these two cards are definitely connected and that one of you guys or some of you guys in the collective are both dealing with this entire situation. And I think you're trying to manifest. But Spirit is saying, believe in the impossible, reach out to uh, the divine in meditation and receive those downloads because they are there to help you um, with resolving this issue. And it will be successful, okay? Um, that six of ones will be turned in the upright as soon as you go in and try to manifest um, the proper way, okay? Um, karma, give me two cards on the karma. Why is this card here for the sign of Libra spirit? Why is the karma card here for the sign of Libra? Two cards on this karma card. Two cards on karma. Yep. 
Yeah, it okay. So it looks like um this is the Queen of Pentacles. So I'm going to say this is a mother energy, possibly, um, or an aunt or someone of an elder in your family um, who is um the matriarch, I want to say. You may have had some difficulty um with regard to your family member and you are trying to make a decision whether or not you are going to try to fix this situation or just leave the situation as is but karma is going to step in and fix this situation for you um, just keep in mind this person may be a taurus virgo and or capricorn that you're dealing with um, over here with the magician card this may be a gemini and or virgo and the lover's card may be a gemini as well that you're dealing with um, so keep in mind this situation looks like a mother energy um, that you are having difficulty with and you're trying to make a decision on whether or not you're going to fix this relationship with this mother energy or if you're just going to let this situation go. Okay, but that decision is going to be up to you. Uh, mature woman, give me two cards on the mature woman. Spirit, if you would give me two cards on the mature woman. What's that all about for Libra in the next 72 hours? What is this mature woman about? Oh, I'm going to take this one because it stayed walking away. Six of cups. Okay, so it looks like this is someone from your past that you know and you know very well. Someone that you have a lot of love for, but you feel like it's just not working. Um, there's difficulties in communication. There's difficulty in um, finding peace and balance. And it looks like you are um, in the next 72 hours going to review and possibly walk away from this situation. Give me two cards, um, Spirit, on the fair man or fair male. Two cards on the fair male, Spirit. Why is the fair male, male here for the sign of Libra? Why is the fair male here for the sign of Libra? Two cards, Spirit. Page of Pentacles in reverse and Two of Cups in reverse. So this is someone um, that you definitely have feelings for, um, but it doesn't look like you guys have been able to be on the same page. Um, lots of feelings and emotions there. Um, it looks like someone wants to make um, the attempt to reach out, um, but um, they're, they're hesitating. This person is hesitating in reaching out to you, but there is still a lot of love there and um, they want to make... A peace offering but they're just not ready to do it at this very moment um so within the next 72 hours uh just know that this person is thinking about you they want to reach out but it doesn't look like they're going to do it within the next 72 hours okay um open relationship what's going on with this open relationship why is it here spirit for the sign of libra why is it here give me two cards to clarify Five of Swords and Seven of Wands in reverse. So it looks like that this this has been definitely um, a situation with uh, this open relationship where one person is in the position of wanting um, to defend the situation, to to want to. I guess develop more from this situation than what you guys originally expected um, and the other person not so much so it looks like it's causing a rift um, in this situation with you guys so I think it's going to take you guys to sit down and have this conversation and get on the same page because originally you guys thought you were on the same page with this open relationship but someone um, does not like the fact that it is open and I think it may be the person that you are in a uh, con uh, in connection with um, Libra because you may be you know a social butterfly and this person didn't expect um, you to continue being that social butterfly while you were in connection with them so I think it's just going to take some communication and you guys talking to try to work that situation out give me two cards on this control um, issue or this control card spirit with the sign of Libra um, for the next 72 hours what's going on with that what is this control card about what is this control card about two cards on the control king of cups in reverse and four of uh, wands in reverse yeah this is this seems like someone uh, the king of cups in reverse can be a very very stubborn 
very uh, cold individual. Um, I'm thinking that you are in a situation where um, your partner or the person that you are in contact with wants things their way or the highway. Um, and they're not moving forward with this relationship with you until you're willing to submit to that idea. Um, and Libra, I don't think that's something that you're willing to do. Um, but that is definitely here. The King of Cups can be a Cancer, Scorpio, and or Pisces. Um, I do have um, some Pinnacles energy on the board. So that could be Taurus, Virgo, and or Capricorn. Um, so it looks like this person is not going to move forward um, until you, um, I guess, agree to allow them to control you, um, which I don't, like I said, think you're going to go for. Um, Libra, this is what I have for you for the next 72 hours. I hope it helps you. I hope it gives you clarity. I hope it gives you peace. Um, until the next time, I'm going to go ahead and leave it there and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.